Using solar power and a motivation from his late wife, a Bazil man found a way to save money and inspire students. New tonight at 10, News 10's Jasmine Dean gets first-hand experience rolling on solar energy. I just rode a solar-powered recumbent trike where I got a chance to learn about the blueprints and the creation behind it. Dwayne Carroll, a retired widow, is the creator of this recumbent trike. It's powered by a single solar panel and made out of recycled materials. Carroll says his late wife in saving money was the inspiration behind this creation. My wife uh, initially got me interested in solar and uh, after her passing, I discovered I had less than $60, $160 a month left in my savings and 401k to last me two years until my social security could start. His trike not only saves some money spent on gas, but it's also a convenient way to get around. Carol says his trike averages 20 miles per hour, but it's gone up to 26. Using one solar panel, Carol is able to fully power his trike with 45 minutes of sunlight and ride for miles. He says the best time to ride it is when it's sunny out and little to no clouds. A calm day with, you know, complete sunshine from day till dark, you know, from daylight till dark is the best day to ride. Carol says what started out as a reason to save money turned into a mission to educate the youth and let them know about the solar car challenge. He says he wants to inspire students to create a program and a solar powered team to compete in the challenge. I'd like to go back and talk to the teachers, see if they're still interested, see if they can get any of their students interested and give them something to look at to give them a little incentive to start their own uh, solar car team. Carol says his trike has gotten him plenty of questions and offers to purchase it, but this model is just a prototype to show students what they can create. His next project, creating another solar-powered trike, but with two seats. In Eunice, Jasmine Dean, KLFY, News 10.